Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, or if you're new here, welcome to my life. Today, I'm going to be showing you guys how I'll be getting ready for Valentine's Day, which is hopefully today if I'm uploading this on time, but who really knows? I'm going to be showing you guys what the fuck I'm going to be doing for Valentine's Day, and make sure you watch till the end because that's when the really important information comes out and on how to have like the best Valentine's Day ever. So I'm going to be showing you guys my whole process of like getting ready and picking an outfit and like all that stuff. The first thing we're going to do is our makeup and I have all my supplies here. I have my mirror right here and I'm just going to like get really fucking hot or something. I don't know. So that's what we're going to be doing first. Let's just get into it. Okay, so the first thing we need to do is put our hair back so it's out of the way while we beat our faces. I'm just gonna use this little clip and like pull my hair back. And probably look like an egg for the rest of this time, so prepare yourselves. Oh, that's hideous! Okay, so the first thing we do is primer, and I'm gonna use this. It's literally not even a primer, but it's pore minimizer, and I have those, so we're gonna minimize them. And it's green tea, so that's supposed to be good for you, I think. I don't really know. But I just put that everywhere, and apparently in my eyeball, too. Ow! I have not put makeup on, like, a full face of makeup, probably since, like, Christmas. So my skin's about to have a nice little shock. And now I let that soak in and dry. So, the next thing I do in my makeup routine is my eyebrows and I'm using this little precisely my brow pencil and I'm just gonna fucking do my eyebrows real quick and I'm probably gonna speed through all this because I have a lot planned for this video and I don't want it to be like all me putting makeup on even though it's gonna take me like fucking hours. <sighs> it's fine. So, eyebrows. I find it interesting that everybody does their makeup in their own order. Why do I do my eyebrows first? I don't know. And I have eyebrows. I don't even do them that dark, but like they're definitely more there than they were before. And while I'm doing this stuff and I'm doing things where it's like taking me a while and I'm not really going to be talking, I'm going to jump through that stuff. Anyways, now that my brows are on, we're going to use foundation because we're going all the fuck out for Valentine's Day. <laughs> and we're using this Fenty Beauty. It's like too dark for me and I might look orange because it's fucking January in April? January in April? Wait, Valentine's Day. Wow, you're literally stupid. Oh my god. It's February in April. <laughs> Do I have a brain? What I was trying to say was this is gonna be too dark for me because it's too dark for me in the summer and it's February in Ohio. So this probably won't match, but it's all I have. And we're gonna use our Morphe X Jeffree Star because, I don't know, I fucking love him and I don't really care if you don't. I mean, you know, teach their own. No hate, now we're gonna do this. But I just do like a little bit, that's probably a lot of it, on every part of my face. This is definitely not how you're supposed to do it, but it's fine. Sorry if I'm also not even looking at the camera. I'm literally just trying to make sure I put this in the right spots. And now we're gonna foundation this shit up. I'm gonna try to make this look decent because you know it's Valentine's Day and we're gonna like pop off. You know what? I definitely look darker. It's definitely not the right shade, but I've seen it look a lot worse. I must say this foundation low-key oxidizes a lot. So sorry, Anna. I also probably shouldn't be using it because it's very matte and my skin is very dry. So that's probably not great for me, but whatever. Okay, I'll be back when this is all blended out. Okay, so now it's like kind of blended in. I didn't really use that much, but I don't want a thick layer because my pores just get clogged so easy. So we're just not going to do it. And now we're on to concealer, ladies. And yes, we're using the famous Shape Tape Concealer because I'm basic and literally... If a beauty guru tells me to get something, I'm probably gonna get it. So, now we're gonna conceal all of our problems. Wow. Like, how do you conceal your whole face though? This is literally my first time doing like a full beat all year. 
because I'm a lazy piece of shit and I just can't be bothered to put makeup on when I'm like just going to school or work or whatever. And now we're just gonna blend it out again. Wow. I will say though, I used to have some ratchet ass acne and it's really gotten better lately except for like this little dude right here that I just tried to cover up. I don't know what the fuck happened there, but hey, so now I'm concealed. I guess, I don't know, you can, you can see this spot right here and like in the mirror it's covered up but on camera it's not and I just don't know what to do about it so we're just gonna leave it because I really don't care that much but I'm still gonna pop off for Valentine's Day. Uh -huh. I'm pretty sure I'm tweaking on caffeine right now so that's really awesome for me. Now I guess we're gonna set my face using this L'Oreal powder from Walmart that I've had for like a million years and it's probably expired just like the rest of this makeup. I use this little elf brush it's a blush brush but it fits really good under my eyes so that's what I do and I just put too much powder on and then tap most of it off and then tuck that shit in there because creases are for old people please don't take anything I say seriously I'm literally like such a disaster just like ignore me like please god I'm not gonna put powder everywhere because like I said this foundation dry as fuck and my skin is also dry as fuck and it just does not need this much going on it but here we are <laughs> Okay, that looks good. Spilling powder everywhere like it's cocaine. <laughs> I literally should not be allowed to like exist. I don't know. We're gonna do bronzer and we have more Fenty Beauty because I got it. It's a little baby size and it hardly shows up on my skin because I don't think it's dark enough, but it's fine. We're gonna be bronze as fuck now. And I just use this brush. It's like fluffy and angled because that's what the beauty gurus told me to do. So that's what I do. Like, does it make a difference? I don't know. I definitely should have tried harder to conceal that zit, but I was just like, Meh, whatever. So I just like put it here on my cheeks and then like up here and down here to like chisel. But also, I don't really know if that works. I'm pretty sure I probably just heard someone say it one time and then I was like, genius, I need to do that. So that's what I do. Like literally nothing I do is because I'm smart. It's all just people telling me things and I just blindly trust them. And I'm like, wow, you're a genius. And that's good enough. <laughs> oh, I almost forgot about my nose. So to contour my nose because it's not even that big and I wanna make it smaller just to be like all the pretty girls in the world. Um, I use the same thing and I use this little angled guy and I just like draw shit on my nose and see if it makes it look cuter. Like this. Oh, this is such a cute angle. Wow, I should, I should be a model. <laughs> like, does this do anything? Do I look cuter? I really don't know. I'm pretty sure you're supposed to put it right here. So we're gonna do that. Okay, so now we're like bronzed and not pasty Ohioans. So now we're also gonna add some blush. I have this Burt's Bees blush because Haley Pham told me it was good and I like her. And to use, put that on, I'm gonna use this angled elf brush again because Manny MUA told me that one, that's who it was. And it just fits so cute and good right here. So now we're gonna make ourselves pink and fun and ready for valentine's day because the whole damn day is pink and so i think we can go a little overboard with it today too since it's valentine's day we can just be pink as fuck and like an e-girl that's who has the blush yeah we'll just be like them we'll go hard as fuck pink as fuck because we're valentine's day as fuck oh that's excessive okay i don't know it's kind of cute though i look all like pink and glowy uh i might have just popped off like I don't know. And next you would think we would do highlighter, but I'm weird and I do highlighter last because I feel like it's like a finishing touch and just really pulls it all together. So now we're gonna prime our eyelids for the eye look and I'm gonna use this Ulta Beauty thing because my mom tried it and told me it was good. So then I got it and now I use it. So I'm gonna go prime my lids and then we're gonna start the fucking eye look. And now my lids have primer on them and now we're gonna do like the fun part and be like creative i'm using the jeffree star blood sugar palette because it's my favorite palette that i've ever owned in my life and it's fucking fucked up on the corners and i might kill myself about it but it's fine we're gonna do like a red moment today like we're just gonna like fucking go for it because it's valentine's day bro like there's hair in it so that's awesome 
We're going to use this little whale brush that I have. I got it in an Ipsy bag. I don't know, but I love it. The first thing I'm going to do is put some cherry soda in my crease. Uh -huh. I literally have no idea what the hell I'm doing. So, honestly, it looks so much better on camera than it does, like, fucking in person. I don't get it. This must be why YouTube people like doing YouTube. Everything looks better when it's not in real life, bro. I'm gonna catch up with this eye and then I'll be back. So for anybody who actually like cares and might be following along with this, I'm sure it's nobody, but just in case, I got you. Now I'm gonna take some prick, the bright fucking red one. Oh, hello light. The bright red one. We're just gonna like put it right like on the top of this part, like to blend it out completely because it's a little bit lighter. And like put it up towards my eyebrow because I'm a beauty guru now and apparently this is a tutorial and not a get ready with me. Honestly, it kind of pops off. I'm pretty impressed with myself. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> okay, so now the next thing we're going to do is use this tiny little brush and we're going to put fresh meat in the corners to make it darker and deeper and more mysterious. And like blend it into the crease a little bit like this. Okay, so now that that's all blended in, this is what we're working with. <laughs> Next is gonna be like the middle part. So we're gonna use the color Blood Sugar. I'm literally only using these four colors apparently. I like the bottom row today. And I'm just gonna put it on my finger and then put it like right here. Because doing it with your finger when it's like a shimmery one like that just pops off more than it does with a brush. So I gotta get real up close and personal to my eyeball to do this. So sorry if you can't see good so much more dramatic than i was going for but it's fine because we're popping off for valentine's day okay so this is going really pretty well i'm not gonna lie i had no idea what the fuck i was gonna do so this is kind of popping off anyways the next thing we're gonna do is take this little flat brush it's a jeffree star morphe brush because i'm a crackhead for jeffree star okay deal with it and we're gonna take this and put it into candy floss and then put it under the eyebrow like this i don't know why i'm talking like this but oh you could kind of see it yeah that's a good topper we're gonna use this little one that we had the fresh meat on again and we're gonna use that to like put it on our lower lash line like this and it just like really deepens the look and just like ties it all together and now to finish off the look, you're going to do some eyeliner because apparently that's important, but I'm not going to record that because I have to get really close to the mirror and it's awkward, so I'll be back when it's on. Okay, so now I have eyeliner and mascara on, and I wasn't going to do false lashes, but then I thought it would kind of pop off, so now I'm going to add some false lashes. Ta-da! I now have <laughs> eyelashes on. And we're almost done. Now all I'm going to do is put on some, guess what, more Jeffree Star product. Who's surprised? Not fucking me. We're just going to put this everywhere and glow like a bad bitch. And also the nose because that's important. And also I'm going to take it and put it right here because <gasps> cute. That was a good idea. Good job, Sam. Okay, so now we're done with that and we're like glowy as hell. And now all we have to do is put on some lip gloss because I don't like lipstick, but I like this all to lip gloss. It's cheap as fuck and cute as fuck, so hey. Mwah, ta-da, we're done. Now you're hot as fuck for Valentine's Day. You're welcome. Just kidding. Setting spray. <laughs> then you'll be hot as fuck. Anyways, now you can take your hair down and stop looking like an egg. And you're just, like, ready for Valentine's Day and hot as fuck. Alright, guys, now I'm gonna go put on an outfit and we'll have, like, a final transformation. I'll be right back. What's good? You're now Valentine's as fuck. I'm Valentine's as fuck. We're all Valentine's as fuck. Congratulations. Just kidding. Here's how it's really gonna go. Yeah, no, like, all jokes aside, I'm really taking all of this off. I, I did that whole face makeup for nothing. I'm not going anywhere. I'm not going out. Like, Valentine's Day? What's that? Can't relate. Here's what I'll be really doing instead. Happy Valentine's Day. Damn, Loki wish I was going out on Valentine's Day because this is a look, baby.